Hello everyone, and uh, and welcome to the next round of uh, the Co-op Championship, the F1 2013 Co-op Championship. My name is Ninis Lukins. My partner in crime in the uh, in the other end of the garage is one KPTK992. How, how are you doing, Kerry? I'm doing fine, thank you. Hello everyone, uh, thanks for tuning in and stopping by to watch us fail to get a podium or a top result and it'll be another struggle for points I'm sure especially at the, the Hungara in Monaco without the walls as they call it uh, and <laughs> yeah I'm looking forward to getting this one out of the way to be honest so well you say that but we probably said the same thing last season but what happened then well it, it, was, a, we, it was we had good memories at, at Hungary we're not gonna we're not gonna go on about that though because no? this is no this is a, a completely different season so far um, we're kind of in a in a car which is kind of the level that we were with in Lotus last season. It's just that the challenges, the, well, the bar has been raised on this on this game. So therefore, it's making it a lot more difficult for us to even score good good results from the back. So uh, yeah, uh, same. We had the it's all the same same variables, but we're just getting different different results this time. So yeah, what what more can you do really? So. We're going to persevere, we're going to keep struggling on. I know people want us to do longer race distance years or do something to kind of sway sway the balance in our favour a little, but we'll, we'll keep going to the end and then maybe, if there is another season, uh, my heart sinks, even at those, the, the mention of that. But I'm, I'm sensing your enthusiasm waning for that already. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, I've got... An Xbox One sat in front of me, <laughs> which I want to play, and I've done. Ditto, ditto. I've I have done, to say, I've done five laps of of this today in the controller, and this feels so different. So, <laughs> I mean, already the signs are looking good for a nearest Lukin's victory today over. His oh, team, don't right? go saying that. Don't go saying that. Well, that's I need to get all the, all the mind games on, on you here uh, because that's not on. Let's get rid of. Let's have mind games, okay? Let's, let's look at a teammate challenge. Uh, Ninus Lukins, uh, as brought to you by Mark Neville, was still being murdered, and that will continue to be the case regardless of whatever happens in this race. No. Um, and I will not hear anything more from Kerry on that. Uh, the grid, Kerry, do you, how about you, uh, you You roll us through the grid? Yeah, sure, okay, so who we got? We got Vettel on pole, the main man, uh, Alonso, uh, Hamilton, so the, the big three going for the championship in the top three there, so it's pretty much their own fight. Podium sealed already, guys, so sorry, no podium here. You might as well watch the next one. Uh, Rosberg, <laughs> Weber, Raikkonen, Massa, Hulkenberg, Grosjean, De Resta, again in 10th, rounds out the top 10. Uh, Sutil, Gutierrez, Ricardo, Bottas, Maldonado, Williams waning a bit still. Uh, jean eric Verne um, is the worst of everyone else apart from us too of course but uh, Bianchi, Peak, Chilton and Van der Gaard round out the top 20 and then the normal positions of us two at the back so uh, yep <laughs> let's see what we can do at, at the Hungara in um, who knows what is going to happen I'm ready to rock and roll yeah I'll just uh, very quickly scroll through the setup screen so everyone still knows that we are doing the default engineer setup as we have been all season long and will continue to do for the rest of this season. Um, just want to very quickly mention, because I got a lot of banter in Malaysia off Kerry for receiving a 10 players grid drop. Um, now, I, I know Kerry doesn't drop any places because he was going to start last anyway, but you also got a grid drop, didn't you, in those little five laps of practice? Well, it was my first flying lap and Vern uh, was on the, the, the corner of... You got a grid drop, mate, didn't it? Vern was sat on the fastest corner on the circuit, so... Do you, what more do you want me to do? Not Should not I just like fire myself into the wall and do no laps of practice? No, no, not that would be for ideal for you, I'm sure, but you know. No, not hit him would be a good idea, but yeah, no, never mind. Quite your one no, that's in the past now. That's in the past. Let's let's move forward onto this race because the lights are up. There's three, and there's now going to be five. Oh, that, my word, that was out quickly. Completely caught me out. Down it. Oh god. Did well not hit anyone to be honest? Oh, no, I didn't say that. And I'm still last, great. Ooh, well do. 
He's just so much friendlier than the Forza 5 AI. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing to see that, isn't it? Whoa, there is a Williams flying in the air. Oh, Gutierrez struggling to stay on. He's... Oh, okay. Jesus, we're just going like three mile an hour. I, I see what you mean now. <laughs> oh, me and Grosjean both hung out to dry there. No idea what Gutierrez is up to. Oh god, yeah, and he's just so that you're in the air there as well. What is going on? Up the inside of Maranado. Bit of a topsy turvy opening lap. But we're through it unscathed, which is a good thing. It's very easy to uh lose a front wing when the AI react as weirdly as they do to some situations. I've got a mile wide here. And the opening lap that I've just had there it worries me because that was too good an opening lap. Which makes me think the AI are on, on, on legend. Oh no, they are. They definitely are. I can't get after Gutierrez at the moment, what's going on? Worth we'll a go on Bottas. Eh? Oh, run wide. Hungary known for its death curbs of course. Especially these outside ones for our sector 2. Much better lap. So far, anyway. You can get him on the outside of Gutierrez here. He's going to leave us a bit of room. Well, fair play. Don't hit the LG sign. When the AI back out of overtaking moves, they just go at like 3 mile an hour. It's really annoying. Why don't I get the RS here? It must have been within a second of them, surely. I'm pull the same move off. We got away with it that time. <laughs> oh, my well, there's a death curve. There's a Macca. What? Okay, that's weird. There's a... There's a McLaren in the wall, which apparently is you. Excellent. And on the map, it's still stuck. Now I'm concerned. Now I've got to run from you because if you get near me, I don't know if you will be invisible or not. Oh, what's going on? Oh God! It still says you're in the wall at the back on the track map. Oh yeah, and I've just been shunted there by Maranello as if I wasn't there. So even the AI just don't think I'm here. Well, well done, Co-Masters. So I, mean, I think is this. Um, am I right in saying this is our first race since the patch came out? Yep. <laughs> that, it is. that is really weird. It's, he's still there, so we're going to pass you by in a second. Well, I'm actually in 16th. I, I, I didn't run wide like, in, in the middle sector, so that was my fault. But then Maranado just pure drove into me as if I wasn't there, and again, it just driven into me like I wasn't there. So I am now going to drive very carefully. Gutierrez knows I'm here. And then Marano just driven into me again. Excellent. And they're still driving. I've got to be we're so careful to now. Corner. I've got to be so careful now. I just have to back out. Oh, he's Marano. not there anymore. Okay, that's, that's, this is so weird. I just have to back out because me, me and Marano were side by side. But because he doesn't think I'm there for some reason, if I had carried on, he just would have shunted me off completely. So this is now just completely ruined my race because I just can't get past him. Oh, I want to 
to stand any chance of getting a top result here. Force India's done a great job of holding these guys up, so... If I want a top result, I've got to do these guys now. Oh, mad move on Weber. That was insane. Of course, did uh, Weber in the closing stages of the last lap on the, uh, the last season at Hungary. Meanwhile, that was a pass for P9. <laughs> Right, so we're up the inside of my ladder now, but is he going to know that I'm up the inside of him when we get to breaking zone? Probably not, because I just went miles up the inside of Gutierrez. Yeah, again, he's... So my ladder still doesn't think I'm here. That's just Maldonado, I think. And now I've just gone. That's just completely... <sighs> yeah, you're not on the mini-map anymore on that on that corner. And that you, just... Well, you're not there anymore on that corner. What? Okay, there you are. That is scary. I'm scared. Quick, call <laughs> Ghostbusters. <laughs> that is really weird. You're just driving. Oh, that was really scary. <laughs> oh, I just can't drive now. It's just, I just completely lost all concentration just because of what on earth is going on. Oh, man. <laughs> I just looked ahead and it was just like a grey car, like in the grab what the chicane. Um, I'm just driving forward. He was moving as well. Oh god. So I so I've experienced something like this in you know a couple of online races. Um, don't be surprised if at some point my ghost drives backwards towards you. Um, <laughs> You'll probably be in the pit stop. What and well, I'll just be sitting there. Fuck me, that is weird. Alright, so we've got to pass Gutierrez again. We're still not using all our curves for some reason. Oh, and I just lost my wing on Marnado because he was going two mile an hour. Ah, uh, now I remember Hungary. Strong on tyre wear. Real hard on tyre wear. No way I'm going to eke out nine laps on this. Oh, there's Lukens. The I'm not surprised you didn't worry about the damage to your front wing. You just drove into the wall. <laughs> On my screen, anyway. Got Marnado behind me again. This is so... Oh, and then there's contact because... Oh! Right, this is a right off this race completely. I just can't do anything until I get away from Marnado. But I can't... I can't pit now to get out of the way because the tires were glassed. This is unbelievable. Alright, these guys were bad on the brakes last lap, so... A lap goes by where we've managed to use all of the curves. Don't believe it. Okay, now the indicator's just come up saying your tyres are really worn. You should pit soon. Oh. Right, but. Oh, death curves. What? What a game! What a game! What a race! What a bunch of developers! Oh, it's just all bad. Box, fuck it, unboxing this lap. What a bunch of developers! Is that a, is that no insult that you've just uh, coined there? Yeah, why not? What a bunch of developers! Near this Lukens. So where are you at now? You just stop there. No, I am coming into the third to last corner now. I need to know where you're at, just in case. Right, the three cars going around the second to last corner now. Is there one just behind it? I don't know. I'm too busy focusing. Oh, screw you then. Wait while I'm boxing. Here we go. It says there's still a dot on the by the chicane, so... Oh, a man that is bit on the same lap. I don't believe it. My life is over. I want to try and get away from him. Unbelievable. <laughs> Top 
tires are finished. We believe the car ahead is running standard rev. Okay, standard he's not at the chicane anymore. Oh my god! Nearly got assaulted. Oh, and uh, that has just ruined my line all the way through this sector. Oh no! Now, now I'm in trouble. Now I was thinking I'd be safe. Well, what's what's happened to you? You're block. further on down the lap, and you just drove forwards onto the circuit. Interesting. Oh, well, I got that take to the grass and evasion and everything. Right, I've got to box this lap. I'm looking forward to seeing your point of view of this because it sounds quite fun. I might just list the video as comedy. Well, is it? But hold on a minute. Isn't that what every video is? Because, you know, we're funny guys, aren't we? Well, your driving is funny. And I would say it's uh, even gone as far as an improvement in this one. Oh, what a long pit stop. Are you serious? All that hard work undone, and that was all your fault as well. Because all I was, my fault. If I'd stayed there, you know, if I'd gone in first out of everyone, I would have been okay. But as it were, maybe, the rest of took advantage of me getting done by you. Incredible. Neil thinking of new ways to screw us up. He's still there. He's still there on the map. I'm dead. I basically got to avoid you there for nine, or oh, sorry, yeah, nine laps. Ten laps. Meanwhile, I'm right back on, on the back of Maranado again, who probably still doesn't know I'm here. We'll see if... We'll, oh, I was oh my say, we'll God. Like now, but over a stair. You're just in a different position every lap at that part of the circuit. Why hasn't the, the game should just disqualify here? <laughs> Well, no, because I'm doing nothing wrong. I'm racing. Hello, I'm here. Hi. Nah. How has he not wiped anyone out? Because he's a ghost, obviously. Evidently not. Or he's a figment of your imagination, because you're the only one who can see it. Great, now I've been jumped by Massa as well. Super late break in, and I'm on the marbles as a result. Thank you, Neil. No worries, mate. You're welcome. That's three positions. I still. <laughs> right, I'll use these cars for cover. Because <laughs> I don't know where you are. Okay, I've seen you on the map. Oh, you're in the wall there, though, so. I mean, it, it, it's, it's one thing that you're seeing me in places that I'm not. But for the AI to not believe I exist is just crazy. Well, theoretically, you can see how they can't oh, see Oh, I was there. Because... Bottas is flying in the air. Obviously if what is going on? Obviously, if they see you on circuit, or like in the barrier, then obviously that's where they think you are. Oh, I've got Weber tucked up behind me. So I've got to do all this again. Got a slow Hulkenberg. Just I can't believe this race. This is unbelievable. I d see, now, I've got a nice little run on my ladder. I'm going to go out the inside because I missed miss, miss my break in. But, and then he just drives into me and I come up there again. It's just, I, I can't do anything. I can't get past him. Right, where's Neil at now? I've got what, like one eye on the map, keeping an eye on where you are. I'll tell you where I am, I'm just going for the first set of timing beam. I think I just saw you. Yeah, you're in the corner.
Oh, Hulkman, because I slow on the brakes. Oh, yeah, I went in a bit. Be careful with the throttle here, because I've oversteered like every lap in the last five. All over my now like a bad rash, but we just can't make a move up the inside because he's not going to leave me room, and he's just going to hit me. So I need to stay nice and tight through these last two corners. Oh my god, Hulkenberg's the liability. And then just try and DRS him. Use a load of curves as well. Okay. Right, that might have worked. We got ahead of Marnado, but we need to stay there. So this needs to be a good clean lap. I don't need any funny business with Bottas, bot that really will screw me over. So we'll just basically barge him out of the way, that work. Oh, and then he gets in my way, oh god, and I'm back behind him again. Oh my god. <laughs> this is such a fun game, it really is. Made by a bunch of developers. <laughs> Well, that lap has just depressed me. Great work, that's a new fastest lap for the race. Depressed you because you're faster than everyone, I don't get it. Yes, because I had a clear opportunity of getting higher up and if it wasn't for you being a twat, then life would have turned out differently. I love how you're actually blaming me for this. Oh, you shouldn't have done whatever you did on lap one to make the game make you think that you're in the wall 24-7. Don't know what I could possibly have done. Still, what an amazing... Oh my god, okay, I've just seen... What on earth was that? I actually don't know what is going on anymore. I don't know if I saw something there or not. <laughs> I'm going insane, clearly. <laughs> I swear I just saw a red car like coming in towards your guy. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I must just be going insane. <laughs> I'm really scared. Well, it appears that my race could indeed be over here in a neat, neat P6 finish. I fear it might be a DNF at any moment in Sector 2. Oh, it looks like there's activity down at that bit of the lap, going to the track map. Oh, no. Oh, turn in, you piece of bloody shit. Yes, that's right. Oh my words. god, bloody he's going shit. on an adventure. Yeah, back in the war he goes. I want this near this Lucas in every race. Really? I want to see what the uh, race director, what his lap time classify you as. If you've even actually, it says you're in twenty second on in this race. So is that actually showing up on your time then? Yeah. Oh dear. Quite a gap between yourself and He's falling around two what is Gutierrez doing, man? A risk. I've done a risky choice there and put the engine in rich, thinking that I can catch these guys. But I'm going to kill my tyres as a result. Good point, I forgot I could use Rich. 
I can't get past Malzanardo. Oh, Rip Sands just sitting there like, yo. Use me. You're getting DRS off him in that, though. You're still getting all like the normal stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Neil does another attempt at driving into the wall. Keep going, Neil. You'll break that wall one day. <laughs> What, 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 what? Mm. Oh, there's Gutierrez as well, excellent. Oh, and then more over there. I, I really hate this game. Oh, I'm even more. Oh, more good. Learn to drive, yo. What's the gap back to Vern, I wonder? Should I just pit? I don't know, 20 seconds is a long way away. Well, interestingly, it says you're you're 19 seconds behind whatever someone, which I don't believe because I still think you're on lap one. We're gonna pit. 15 <laughs> seconds back to Vern. We we might lose a place or two. We might get it back straight away. I don't know. I don't really care. I just wanted to basically it's basically still the fastest lap, lol. Be funny if it gets taken off you yeah, because you're classified as 20 second. That would be fun, but hopefully it won't. That will be the icing on the cake, I think. There's Vern. Oh, Neil's on the other side of the circuit this time. He's getting closer around the lap. Go on, Neil, you can complete a lap before the end of this race. <laughs> Making significant inroads on Rosberg. We might have a race on still. We stay ahead of Vern out of pit stops. Gonna put it in lean just to make sure that we got enough for a lap of rich. I think I think this is. A, I'm just doing this, viewers, just to to prove to, well, myself as well as you that, you know, I, I had I had decent pace here. I probably could have uh, been up around carry had it not been for well. Partly for me being an absolute retard and just oversteering like a dickhead everywhere. Um, but also, you know, AI cars knowing that I was there and everyone not killing me. Keep telling yourself that. No, I'm, I'm going to show you, mate. Whereas now, are we still in the same place of the wall? No, it doesn't really count though, does it, when I'm on like seven year old tyres. It does. Deal with it. I'm on like 2006 Michelins. Deal with it. I will deal with it in, in, in a nice P6 with fourth right under my nose. For a lap to go. Maximum attack for one lap. Can't get the traction out of the corner. There we go. Tires are reaching the end of their life. Death curb trying to end me there. But I'm worried about another person who's going to end me. His name's Nillis Lukens and he's around Sector 2 somewhere. Where is he? Still in his normal spot, right? Maximum attack on Raikkonen. No, isn't it? Vettel wins it. Kimi breaks incredibly slowly. Couldn't get the traction to stick one up the inside for this last corner. Well, P2 
P4 was nailed on there until um, fate intervened. It also has an alias called Nidus Lukins. So yeah, there we go. The race is finished and P5 actually, which is quite good considering a couple of laps ago I thought P, P well, I wouldn't even catch Rosberg up. So to be in the mix at the end there with those top guys, that's a good result. That's a good result. Like I said, the top three were now done anyway, so... <laughs> Best of the rest is what we're aiming at at the moment. Fastest lap, yo! Yeah. <sighs> right, we scroll down to check where Neil is. Oh, he's 16. Well done, Neil. You just jumped up loads of places. <laughs> Who'd have thought that? <laughs> right, what was your lap time actually? Interestingly, 21.2. Is that it? That is that, poor. That, that is it. poor. It's fastest lap, mate. I don't care. Nil, no, that is it. poor. What were you doing? It's, it's fastest lap, mate. Jesus Deal with it. Christ, I was expecting like a 19 or something. Anyway. This, that, 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 that's, that's, that, that means I got two in a fastest lap column. That's, I mean, if, if, if we're talking teammate hands and we're talking stats, that, that's what it matters, mate. It's pretty embarrassing. But you keep, <laughs> you keep clutching straws, mate. And uh, we'll take a look at the final results. Vettel, Hamilton, and Alonso ran that. The podium, as like I say, I expected, it was nailed on for sure there. Uh, Raikkonen uh, was fourth just, and I managed to actually get on the back of him. So we had pace, we had front running pace today. So um, fifth place is all we could manage, following circumstances out of my control. Uh, Nico Rosberg sixth, Paul the rest of seventh, Hulkenberg eighth, Massa ninth, and Weber rounds out the top ten. So Massa and well, those those four guys there ran out the top ten were kind of locked together for the entire race there. So the rest are doing a fine job hanging on there. Uh, Adrian Sotil um, is the first of the non-point scorers. Grosjean, um, disappointing for him. Uh, Bottas, Maldonado, Gutierrez and Nil, you're in 16th. I'll, I'll say no more there. Uh, Vern, Ricardo, Bianchi, Chilton, Van der Gaard, and Peak. So Marussia looked like they've overtaken Caterham. I can't safe. believe you say that as if I've been an absolute, like, reety. It's, you, you're on about... Well, you should have tried you're, something you're about Clearly things. you were getting hit. Clearly nothing was working, so try something different. And, no. Nah, well, yeah, but what different could I have tried? Like, like I said, I couldn't pit three laps earlier because the tyres on the last so I would have had to pit twice. So I, I couldn't do that. <sighs> there we go. Yeah. There's the results. And uh, let's see how that affects the championship standings. That's a real nice fight that I wish I was a part of. <laughs> yeah. That is a real nice fight. Vettel, um, with that victory, seems to have stolen top spot um, going into the virtual summer break, as as you would call it, according to the calendar. Uh, Alonso and Hamilton, not far behind. We're in for a Titanic scrap, I think, between those three, which is great. And if only we had a fight like that in uh, the real championship. Yeah, quite. It would make the sport worth watching at the moment. Um, I'm fourth. Um, I don't know where that's put me. I think that, that maintains position actually. So, best of the rest is all we can hope for at the moment, and that's about as much as I can do. Uh, Rosberg, Weber, Massa, Raikkonen, Grosjean, Lotus, real, really underperforming. Uh, Hulkenberg tenth there, and Neil looks to have lost some points to Hulkenberg there after his point scoring finish. You're gonna get when? When are you gonna get 20 points, Neil? Um, when. Manalado stops crashing into me because he, he doesn't think I'm there. We'll move on. Paul De Resta, Gutierrez, Sutil, Ricardo, Maldonado are the final point scorers. Vernon Bottas yet to get on the score sheet, and of course, Marussia and Caterham likewise. So, Constructors Championship. Mercedes lead the way by virtue of Rosberg doing a better job than Weber. Uh, Red Bull, uh, Ferrari at top three. It looks like they're uncatchable. We have managed to climb onto fourth going into the summer break. Which is a fine achievement, I think. I was going to say a miracle, to be honest. But yeah, a fine achievement worked as well. Why not? We are winning thanks to that those 15 points you contribute. So I may criticise your, your point scoring, but at the moment it's it's enough to hang on. So you keep doing what you do, Neil, and <laughs> we'll see where the cards fall. <laughs> hey, my, my 15 points, if, if I only draw 15 points, you'd be beaten, we'd be tied with Force India. Don't underestimate my contribution to this team. Oh, anyway, <laughs> Lotus, uh, Salber and Force India are kind of 
on the same level there, but Sauber leads the way. Uh, Toro Rosso and Williams both on a point, and Marussia and Caterham yet to score. So those are the standings going into um, the final two races of the European season. It's uh, <laughs> yeah, been been uh, interesting European season so far. So uh, let's see if we can get any any. Uh, major results in the next couple of races. Got some great circuits coming up, Neil. Where are we at next, Neil? Spa is next, um, oh, great. which I'm super happy with because I love Spa. Um, and well, we'll 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 see if I'm just you know um, uh, fooling around with with Kerry's vision and uh, his you know his race. Again, next time round, then we'll also see if any other cars just don't believe I'm there um, when we get there. But um, if if none of that happens, which I admit at the moment is a long shot, if none of that happens, um, I'm really hoping for a big result there. It was raining last season when we went there, and I didn't get as big a result as I was hoping. So um, yeah, we'll see. Um, but until then, until that next event, uh, I've been Dennis Lukins. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. I've been KPTK92, um, the champion McLaren driver so far. Um, it's looking very likely that the teammate challenge is going to be won by me again for another season. So um, yeah, that will be decided actually on it in the next race, or has it already been won? It already has, yeah. Because oh, it's it, already been it, won. It, well, we, we, we've done ten races, and there's only like nine left. Yay me! So I'm I'm going for a glass of champagne to celebrate, um, and I'll see you at Spa. Cheers, guys.